Hi, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to stream from OBS to either YouTube or Facebook with a recorded video, with a pre-recorded video. That means uh, you want to go live, but you don't want to actually be live. You can use a recorded video to go on a live stream. Yeah, this can um, keep your social media profiles active in the days where you are very busy. Okay, so someone, I have a few people that have asked me how they can do this and that's why I'm doing the video. So, we're going to be using OBS and um, if you don't know, I've uh, done a video in the past where I teach how to stream using OBS to YouTube and to Facebook. And another video where I taught how to multi stream to both Facebook and YouTube at the same time. So I'm going to leave the links of these videos in the description. Um, you can check them out. Okay, so let's get into it. The first thing is I'm on my Facebook page. I want to stream, so I'm going to click on live video. Come down here, go live. Okay, so it has opened up. I'm going to copy this. Go to my OBS settings uh, under stream settings. Under stream settings, go to stream key here. Okay, and I'm going to test it. So I'll click on start streaming. Let's see if it's working. Start streaming. It should show here. Should show here yeah, this connect you so okay you can see it's working now just marked it. so there's a connection the next thing will be to add post detail so the video i'm doing the video i want to stream let me add it here but i'm going to just put the title before i add it so i already have the title it's a video i've done before yeah so uh, i'm going to copy this and paste it here Save this. Okay, let's go to OBS now. So the next thing is for us to go live, but we have to set up the OBS. So this is the OBS dashboard. This is your preview scene where you can make all the changes and um, editing on your presentation or your live stream. You can do all the changes here, but when you take it to this program scene, this is already live. Once it's here, this is what people will see. So the good thing is, if you don't see this dashboard, choose studio mode. When you choose studio mode, it breaks this dashboard. And the, the advantage is that it helps you make changes that will not directly reflect on the live stream. In case you are making mistakes, you can decide to correct those mistakes before you put it on the live version. Okay, so that is it. So, how do we stream a, a recorded video? If we are streaming from a video capture device source like a camera will come here click on video capture device but instead we are going to media source okay so we'll click on media source click on ok and check for the file so i'm going to just check for where the file is i know where it is so so this is it this is the file once I press play now, I can come here and go live. So let's do it. Okay, so you can see it. I can. So let me go live. Once it goes live, I will start. Okay. Okay. So make sure that all other audio, all audio, all other audio devices are turned off. Like the desktop audio, make sure it's turned off. Uh, only leave the audio of the media source, which is the video that is playing. The reason why we do that is because if your desktop audio is turned off, as I'm talking, or any sound happening here, where the streaming is going on, will be reflecting online. That is very unprofessional. So you don't want that to happen. So make sure, make sure you turn it off. Okay. 
just make sure that it is turned off while the streaming is going on so there will be no kind of lags like that. So this will be over in three minutes and you can check the live stream, you can see the live stream is going on. You can come here to meet the audience. When if they are leaving a comment, you can come here to relate with them. You can check the health of the live stream here. If this has not yet brought out. This is the link to the live stream that you can share with people, with your fans and your audience to join the live stream. You can copy this link and share it. Okay. So the video has come to an end. We can stop streaming and uh, yeah, come to Facebook and end the live stream. The video has come to an end. End it. We are done with the live stream. The video has been this a four minute video. So you can try this when you are not chance to be live. You can use a recorded video to go live on either Facebook or YouTube. Um, Please, if you learned something from this video, make sure just leave a comment. And if you have some questions or something didn't work right for you, please leave a comment. I'll be there to reply. You. And if you have a suggestion for a video you would like us to do, also you can leave your uh, content, your video suggestions for us in the comments. I will choose the best five ideas. Okay. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on your notifications until I come your way again. Thank you.